chapter 2 uh, I it's uh, the book of Mark chapter it's like it's uh, the book of Mark chapter 1 uh, verse uh, 15 you know I'm sorry 14 says and after it says uh, Mark chapter 1 verse 14 says now after that John was put into prison Yahweh came into Galilee preaching uh, the gospel of the kingdom of, of Yahweh because uh, he was not preaching his own doctrine, his own gospel. He came to do the will of the Heavenly Father. Uh, it says, and saying, the time is fulfilled, and the kingdom of, of the Most High Yahweh is at hand. Repent ye and believe the gospel. Uh, that's, all, that's all there is to it, man. It's about repenting unto Yahweh Hashem uh, and believing the gospel. Because uh, well, once you start believing in the, in the, uh, the gospel, okay, and when you repent, that means what? Uh, you're actually considering your ways, like it says in the book of Haggai, uh, and, and looking on, on, onto Yahweh Hashem Shai, realizing, hey, we have all we have been all been as, as lost sheep. Uh, we have all gone gone astray. Just search the scripture real quick on Yahweh Shai. Uh, uh, Yahweh Shai, chapter Okay, this is uh, St. John chapter 8, uh, verse, uh, verse 24. This is uh, St. John, verse uh, 8, verse 24. Verse, uh, it says, uh, I said therefore unto you that ye shall die in your sins. For if ye believe not that I, I am he, ye shall, ye shall die in your sins. Because right? you don't believe in Yahweh in, in Yahu Shah. Right? If you don't believe in Yahweh Shah, basically you don't believe in the Moksha because he is the mediator. All right? And if you don't believe in the mediator, all right, you're going to end up in these different philosophies, Christianity, Islam, Hinduism, all these different religions, uh, black consciousness, uh, Egyptology, all these different made up uh, philosophies, man. Vain uh, imaginations of men. All right? And guess what? You're going to, you, you're basically, uh, you will be uh, fulfilling your, your, your role. Okay? Because it says here, it says, uh, uh, Matthew chapter 7 verse 14 uh, it says uh, because straight is the gate uh, Matthew chapter 7 verse 14 says because uh, straight is the gate and narrow is the way which leads unto life and few there be that find it Okay, because these different philosophies that we have today and as well they have numbers man, uh, a whole lot of numbers behind them but the most highest zone are looking for a very few number man. the elect, the chosen uh, a small portion, man, because in Isaiah, it speaks about us being a, and being an uh, being as a, it says a small sanctuary unto the Most High, because right. it's gonna be only few that be they're gonna find this way. It says uh, Matthew seven and fourteen says because straight is the gate and narrow is the way which leadeth unto life, and few they be that find it. All right, because mo most people who, who come across. Uh, the men of the Lord on the highways and edges, they somehow think this to be a joke. Uh, somehow we, we are the crazy ones. All right. All of the all these different madness, these people which are teaching are teaching people and are and are commanding people to observe these different uh, traditions of men. 
somehow we are the ones who are actually being looked at as, as being insane, all right? Because well, because insanity in this society has been normalized, all right? So what even even actually uh, come to say is uh, is is, uh, is common sense? You know, you know, it's, common sense is not always common, man. Okay. In fact, let me get this. Uh, was that in the Exodus? All right. I believe it's 20, 22 or 23, all right, because the straight gate that few are going to be, few that are going to find it, okay, those are the ones who are going to not follow, okay, the wisdom of this world, like it says in, in, the, in, in the Corinthians, the first chapter, whereby the wisdom of the Most High being wiser than, than men's wisdom, okay, it says uh, Exodus chapter 23, verse uh, Uh, it's uh, Exodus chapter 23, verse, uh, verse 2 says, Thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil. Because uh, this wide, uh, broad way that, that most uh, are falling into it, they're being followed by a, a whole lot of multitude men. Okay? They have numbers behind them. Just because people are doing something because it's trending, because uh, it, the society has uh, deemed it as, as the norm, that's not that's not make it does not make it right okay whatever thing that is righteous it, it must be according to the holy scriptures uh, if not if it's not the righteousness of Yahweh but it is wickedness all right it says um exodus 23 verse uh two, verse 2 says thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil neither shall thou speak uh so that here it says neither shall thou okay uh speak in a cause to decline after many to wrestle judgment all right in fact there's a, another word another scripture was that in, in jeremiah because a lot of these people who are, who are uh, uh not following not, not even entering to the straight gate all right they all leaning upon their own understanding like it says in the book of proverbs even jeremiah says it i mean in fact let me just get this in jeremiah real quick all right, so the book of Jeremiah 17, verse, uh, verse, uh, instead of verse 9, I'm going, to, I'm going to jump up to verse 5, it says, Jeremiah 17, verse 9 says, The heart is, this, is, uh, is this, deceitful above, above all things, and, and, despite, uh, slacky, and desperately wicked, who can know it? Uh, how can you therefore want to try to to, uh, to believe in, in your own heart? Because uh, that's exactly what the, uh, the majority of people are doing out, out in the world, man. Okay, who not who are not inclined to the spirit of Yahweh Hashem Hashem? They're leaning onto their own understanding. Uh, that's why Scripture says, "Trust in the Lord with all thine heart." As and I says, uh, "And lean not into your own understanding." I believe in Proverbs 20, 27. Let me just get his approvals. Uh, so that gave Proverbs chapter 28, verse uh, 20, 26. Uh, it says, uh, it says uh, Proverbs chapter 28, verse uh, 26 says, He that trusteth in his own heart is a fool, but whoso worketh wisely, he shall be delivered. All right. That's why it says in Matthew 7 chapter, there are going to be few that, that find it. Uh, those few that find it, those are the ones who are going to be delivered. All right. In fact, let me just go to this. Uh, is that in, uh, when one of the disciples asked Yahweh Shai, right. I believe it's the book of Luke. All right. Because one of the disciples asked Yahweh Shai, and he says, Lord, will there be many which which perish the day that 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 be that day that be uh, be saved? All right. Because because they knew, all right, they, they knew very well about right, that there's gonna be very few that are gonna find that that narrow path. Those are gonna enter into the straight gate. Right. That's what it was. 
Uh, that's why the scripture says, man, uh, what is that scripture in, uh, in Acts? Uh, it speaks about being uh, uh, saying now, what then have, have, have Israel not obtained that which he seeketh for? But it says about the election of obtaining and the rest, they were what? They were blinded. Because uh, only elections are the one, they, they elect, the election are going to obtain salvation. Because well, the rest, they've been what? They've been blinded. Alright? Because that is uh, the intention of the Heavenly Father, like it says in the book of Isaiah, was that six, uh, it speaks about that, man. Okay? Say, look, man, uh, the Most High have, have, uh, has what? Has blinded these people. Alright? At least through this glorious uh, gospel of the kingdom should be, uh, should be shined onto them. Alright? Because here's a, here, here's a, um, uh, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? Here's a, an absolute purpose uh, for making sure that the two thirds do not make it in, do not enter into his rest. Uh, in fact, let me just get Zechariah. You know what? Let me just get Acts chapter 28, 26. I believe. Is it 20 or 20, 28 or 26? So the book of Acts, chapter 20, now I've said it, is the Acts chapter 20, 28, it's lucky. Acts chapter 28, verse, uh, verse 26, all right, because in Corinthians it also speaks about, like I've said, you know, if this gospel of the kingdom, uh, if our gospel be hid, is to hid, it is hidden to them that are lost, uh, it says uh, at chapter 28 verse 26 saying instead of 2025 20, at 28 verse 25 it says and when and when they are agreed not among themselves uh, of course there's going to be still be division there's going to be those who are going to still be doubting in the doctrine that's been brought up by 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 the servants of Yahweh Shemashah his holy prophets your yeah, the beginning of the apostles and elders, elders of great most of going on down it's going to be still be those who are going to be doubting uh, until jeremiah 28 and 8 when it says uh, then shall they know they've been a, they've been a prop then shall they know that the most high have truly sent those prophets when when all these things that that the men of the lord have been saying throughout uh the years uh when when all when all these things come to pass only by then shall you truly believe man that Yahweh have truly sent them. Alright. It says, uh, And when they agreed not among themselves, they departed after Paul had spoken one word, who well, spake the Holy Spirit by Isaiah the prophet, uh, says, uh, Unto our fathers, saying, Unto him these people, and say, Hearing ye he shall hear, and shall not understand, and seeing ye shall see, and not, and not perceive. Because uh, they're not going... Uh, through uh, the proper channels, right? They're going through the, the broad way, of which most people are. Hey, man, they're going to end up agreeing, okay, uh, into doing into doing all form, forms of wickedness, man. Right? Uh, just because something is in, uh, the, just because the majority of people are in agreement, does not make it right, right? Just like we have these laws that have been uh, these different constitutions, these laws that ESO the so-called white man has, has, has implemented uh, and have, have made them have, have uh, make sure that people follow them just because this it says is uh, certain things is, is lawful does not make it righteous man uh, does not make it good and beneficial to the people uh, man-made laws are uh, amen they're not perfect they're far from being perfect anyway I uh, says so that for verse 27 says and for the heart of these people is wax gross and their ears are dull of hearing and their eyes have they closed these they should see with their eyes and hear with their ears and understand with their heart and should be converted and i shall heal them because the most does not heal does not want to heal okay the rest of the 12 tribes of the nation of yasharala which are you so-called negroes latinos and native americans and those of you have been scattered among these different nations the most high has a specific purpose man for having the two thirds been cut off and dying okay let me just get the last scripture you know
Uh, let me just get this last, last, last precept on. The start of the book of Luke, okay, chapter 13, verse 23. All right. It says, uh, then one of, it says, uh, look, Luke chapter 13, verse 23 says, Then said one unto him, Lord, are there, are, are there few that be saved? And he said unto them, Strive to enter in at the straight gate. For many, I say unto you, will seek to enter in and shall not be able. Uh, you, hey, just like you see people, when, 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 even the basic things, man. The color scriptures when telling Luke the law was a so-called uh, black man from the tribe of Judah man, uh, which will be the so-called Negroes today. They find it very difficult to believe that man. Okay, they can't even understand the basic things man, basic principles of judgment. Uh, what's good and what's righteous, what's 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 clean and what is unclean. Uh, cause well, cause it, it was not given unto them. That's what the Lord even he said, look man. Because unto you it is given to those to, to, know, to know the mysteries, but unto, unto them it is not given. Because right? only those who, who have been given this uh, the truth, who have been uh, uh, who have been uh, been gifted this gift, okay, of understanding, uh, are, the, are the the same ones who are going to walk mournfully before the sight of Yahweh who are going to strive and to enter into the straight gate. All right? It says uh, Luke chapter 13 verse 24 it says in start of verse uh, 23 again it says then said one unto him Lord are there few that be saved and he said unto them strive to enter in at the straight gate for many I say unto you will seek to enter in and shall not be able all right and and that's it man okay with that all praises on and glory be unto Yahweh Bashim Yahushah Bashim Rakakotash that runs unto the apostles and also great most of Shalom to you, I laboring and also in spirit of heart across the four corners. Shalom unto the elect. Peace, love, and respect and mercy unto the elect. Shalom.